Yeah, start from up here. What's up, people? Uh, it might not be one o'clock yet. Somebody said I always work at one o'clock in the morning. It's twelve forty-five. It's twelve forty-five, man. It ain't one o'clock this time. All right. So you know, I don't always work at one o'clock in the morning. I will be working then a little bit. I'm about done for the day. I'm pretty tired. I got up at like 11 o'clock today, which I know is not bad for you guys, but I'll go to sleep at like 6.30. Um, to meet a guy to sell this washer and dryer in this fucking house, and then he didn't want it, which, you know, I don't know, he was fucking weird anyway, but anyway, uh, then I went and scrapped a refrigerator. Old refrigerator didn't work. You know, you down around here, you can go scrap them, get money for it. I think scraps down right now. I got a big uh, $18.90. So uh, two Red Bulls, pack of smokes. There's ten bucks, and then uh, my truck uh, sucks gas like a motherfucker. So you know, yeah, that was cool. But anyway, uh, pouring down in rain uh, throughout the day a little bit. Uh, started I don't know a few hours ago, and it was pouring. It stopped now, but it was like pouring balls. So uh, you know what I had to do. Uh, I had to get, fucking get on it and get my Civic in the garage, you know, and, uh, well, what well, do you know? Here it is. I got, I got my car stuff over there. Kind of got some things cleaned up on it. Uh, I will never, I'll probably never, ever watch the Civic again until it gets painted, which uh, could be, you know, uh, 20 years down the fucking road. Every time I've washed the Civic, like uh, with a hose or car wash, bad things have happened, and I ain't shit neither. The last time I had a bad fucking feeling, and, um, I did it anyway for Slamology, and my fucking fuel pump went out on the way up there. I never watched it again, but I do watch the windows. Uh, kind of streaky. Um, but, you know, it's pretty, this is fucking awesome. Uh, I know it's like probably nothing. Uh, if you got a garage, it's like, oh, wow, you know, uh, fucking woo. But if you, like me, and never had a fucking garage to work in, you can't work in the fucking rain. I had like a shitty carport that leaked and fucking like shit on my head and I was about to fall in and shit because I built it. But um, yeah, I'm fucking pretty stoked about it. Hey, people who don't show their license plates, there's my fucking license plate. My fucking team. Yeah. TV drag racing. A little dark. Oh. Yeah. I did, uh, got the batteries out. Batteries are out. Battery box is out. Um, I think that might work actually fucking perfect for uh, the 810 box. I uh, got every spare tire and everything out. Let's keep it clean. I like to keep it clean or do what I can. I got a small leak and it kind of puddles down here once in a while. Hopefully I won't have that problem since it'll be in the garage all the time. Uh, but, you know, I might get caught out in the rain. But, um, yeah. Uh, tomorrow is a big day. Uh, my boy Michael Stoney. Mr. Stoney's coming over, and uh, we're going to get some shit done, hopefully, because uh, it's time to quit fucking around, you know. It was like, eh, time to quit fucking around. So, got some shit to do. Had some skank up in there. Had to clean on the inside. and Make sure I had oil and shit, because it likes to leak oil sometimes, but for some reason it wasn't bad. I'm going to uh, share a secret. Sorry, my camera shut off. But if it ain't one thing, it's another. Uh, my memory card was full. I want to share a secret with you. I don't usually share all my secrets, but um, I'm going to do something that uh, probably increases your decibels probably by uh, maybe four to five decibels. Uh, first step when adding new equipment. And um, you know, I'm going to go ahead and share this with you, and you can thank me later. So uh, give me a couple minutes and. You'll see that's what that secret is. Alright. People ready for this secret? Ugh, man, it took me a while, kind of. Probably like a half hour, or fuck, maybe even 45 minutes. Here comes my secret. To add decibels before even adding music. Or equipment, sorry. You add... Decals, motherfuckers. Big ass, huge, rob this fucking car decals. Yeah. And if you can, 
if you can, make sure you get them crooked as fuck. The other side, wow. I don't know if you'll be able to see it because it's dark over here. Yeah, hold on. Look at it compared to the DB drag underneath of it. <laughs> Don't fucking line up with the top on one sticker and the bottom on another sticker on a Civic because they are different. I had good faith in this one. I was like, oh, fuck yeah. Yeah, because I fucking hate putting on decals. It's like the worst. I fucking hate it. I can't get them off the sticky fucking paper. And then when I go to put them on the window, especially bigger ones. You know, this one's like, you know, fucking, it's a bigger one. It's a fucking bitch to me. I don't, I can't get it down. I've seen guys put on decals like in decal shops and they like, fucking put some tape over here on this side and over here and look at this and I I just don't get it but uh and I get air bubbles and shit ah oh, man I don't know but I know I just added like four decibels and there's no fucking audio in this thing yeah I can't even hear the fucking the mids because I got no mid amp hooked up so yeah just my little secret and for everybody who doesn't know how to spell my fucking name, uh, see if you can see that. Uh, can you see it? Maybe. Casper Scaffs. There's a glare on it. Now maybe I won't get my fucking name spelled wrong everywhere. Shit, yeah. But, uh, you know, we gotta tell you that secret. And, and this way, you know, it won't be so hard on the thieves, you know. It's a fucking hard life, you know, if you're a thief, I guess. I've never been a thief. Ever. Ever. I don't fucking steal. I despise thieves. But, I can assure you that it's probably a hard job. Because, you gotta run around, looking in people's cars. Look, he just looked at this one. No, I ask a DB drag, you probably might, you know, fucking thief, they're mostly retarded, so they'd be thinking, you know, I got performance parts under the hood, when actually there ain't nothing but a big battery. Soundstream, DB drive, big Soundstream sticker on the back, oh man, he knows. Fuck the other cars, this car right here, I mean, it's all windows, so he can just come look in, there's no tent, I mean, and then, makes it easier on a thief, you know, they just, they know, they, this is the car to break in right here, no need to look anymore. Could be thousands upon thousands of dollars worth of equipment in here. So make sure you add you some decals. But when you do that, make sure you get you a fucking alarm. Actually, you know, I'm being sarcastic. Uh, I like decals because this is my uh, my show car. E even though it looks like shit. But it just means I, I drive it to shows and that's it. That's it. Nowhere else. Maybe to town to put gas in it or something. But... Probably not even that. I'm probably it'd probably be trailered to finals, so I won't even drive it there. I'll just drive it on and off the trailer. And um, other than that, I won't leave my garage. So yeah, so be careful with decals. Get an alarm. This has I have an alarm on here. It's pretty sweet. Uh, it's a cheapo Viper. Luckily, I got a buddy that can install alarms, even though he fucking hates to do them. But good dude. Um, until tomorrow. Yeah, decal world.